It captured our attention on the eve of its very announcement with its interesting choice for a chipset, among all the other things it has going on for it such as the genuine leather back panel, competent camera setup, and alluring price tag. A strong seller the LG G4 wasn't, but it got more people than ever talking about LG handsets. This means even more people will be talking about its successor, the LG G5, when it shows up sometime in the first quarter of 2016. There's also a strong possibility of iris scanning security coming to the smartphone. You can read more about that, and other interesting aspects of the LG G5 below. Oh, and in case you don't feel like plowing through the whole thing here's just the gist of it. Design, unlike its plastic predecessors, the LG G5 will have a metal body, a first for LG since its Shine series of feature phones from the recent past. Hardware, the Qualcomm Snapdragon 820 system chip is the one expected to power the LG G5. Iris scanning security is a legitimate possibility. Display, a 5.6 inch, 1440 x 2560 resolution IPS LCD panel is expected. No force touch or other semi unexpected surprises here. Camera, 20MP rear cam with a sensor from Sony, 8MP front cam, laser autofocus, color spectrum sensor, who knows what else it's LG. Release date and price, Q1 2016 announcement and release. Price tag north of $600. The LG G5 might be in initial production as we speak. Design. Waving plastic goodbye, LG takes a major step forward in design with a full metal body. Save for the odd faux chrome frame here and there, LG has consistently sidestepped the metal and glass premium design tendency, opting to make the most out of plastic. Its reasoning has been that a plastic build allows for user-friendly features, such as memory expansion via micro SD slot and a removable battery. Paired with unusual material choices, such as the genuine leather covering the LG G4S back panel, this brought a level of differentiation to its smartphones, and also let the company keep somewhat lower prices for them. However, straying from the beaten path didn't bring LG's handsets quite the attention that they deserve. And, if nothing else, the LG V10S stainless steel sides indicate that management knows it's time for a change. Hardware The Qualcomm Snapdragon 820 SoC and an iris scanner by Irians are highlights in the LG G5S spec sheet. Knowing LG's capacity to overstuff its high-end models with technology, borrowed from unusual sources like smart vacuum cleaners, it is beyond doubt that the G5 will be a technological beast. However, LG smartphones are notoriously immune to any leaks happening months in advance at best, we're left with he said, she said type of hearsay to ponder. Still, we have plenty of speculative and mysterious Taiwanese source said. Infos to throw your way, so grab a samak and a cup of joe while you're at it. Processor and memory. Rumors point at the Qualcomm Snapdragon 820 system chip as the one in charge of powering the LG G5 globally. Mind you, it's not like LG can't pull off a surprise punch and ship the smartphone with a chip of its own making, or opt for MediaTek's latest high end silicon, the Helio X20. However, this is merely within the realm of possibilities. LG still hasn't given out any indications of having a premium tier application processor ready for prime time, and it's also not a Mediatek customer for the time being. Given that, and LG's long-standing collaboration with Qualcomm, the Snapdragon 820 seems like the most obvious choice of processor for the LG G5. Likewise, the new Adreno 530 GPU is up to 40% faster than the Adreno 430 before it, and the processing units will be paired with no less than 3GB, 
possibly 4 GB, of the fastest and most power efficient LPDDR4 RAM there is. The chip also features Qualcomm's Quick Charge 3.0 technology, which will inevitably decrease the time it takes to charge the G5S thick battery. Storage wise, the base model LG G5 will probably ship with 3 2 GB of expandable flash memory. We haven't heard any rumors about LG shopping insanely fast UFS storage from Samsung or other vendors, so the firm will most probably stick to the tried and true EMMC standard. We also aren't sure whether LG will ship other storage size variants, given that the LG G4 was only sold with 32 GB of memory. Iris Scanning Biometric Security LG G5 Rumor Review a powerhouse with a metal body, Snapdragon 820 chip, and iris scanner security. The presence of iris scanning biometric security is among the most persistent, and also plausible rumors surrounding the LG G5. We remember hearing something like this about the Galaxy S5 and the LG G3 months before their introduction last year. Back then, it sounded straight up sci-fi, but in 2015, iris scanning is already a thing in consumer-grade electronics. This year, Fujitsu and ZTE became the first to ship smartphones with optical security, in Japan and China, respectively, but it was really Microsoft to break it out globally with the Lumia 950 and 950 XL. We are fond of how quickly and reliably the iris scanner works in the Windows 10 Hero phones, so we're eager to see what LG could potentially make of it. In short, iris scanning could make for an even faster and more secure solution than fingerprint scanning, which already feels reliable for the most part. Speaking of which, the LG G5 will probably have a fingerprint reader as well. Display a 1440x2560 resolution IPS LCD screen with a purported size of 5.6 inches by diagonal is rumored, though 4K isn't entirely out of the question. There are two big questions surrounding the LG G5S display. Will LG make a leap towards 4K resolution screens in the manner it did two generations ago with the LG G3S Quad HD screen? And will the Koreans trick out the LG G5 with one of their special flexible OLED panels in a bid to outgun its arch rival, Samsung? Thus, we expect the LG G5 to come with a 1440x2560 resolution IPS LCD screen with a purported size of 5.6 inches by diagonal, which sounds a little odd, but still within the realm of possibility. Perhaps the size has something to do with the smartphone's new metal clothes and maximizing the screen-to-body ratio. Hopefully that's the case. Camera A 20MP rear cam and 8MP front cam along with whatever crazy new tech LG may come up with. The LG G4 won a fair bit of praise for its competent 16MP camera that came with features such as manual mode, laser autofocus, and color spectrum sensor. The subsequent LG V10 literally doubled down on its momentum with a killer dual front camera setup, which basically takes the ultimate group shots. We don't know for sure how LG plans to follow up on its fast-growing camera legacy with the LG G5, but we have heard a rumor or few. LG is expected to employ a 20MP or bigger camera sensor from Sony, be it an off-the-shelf component or a custom-made chip. Meanwhile, the front camera will probably stay at 8MP, although LG might be in the mood for upping the megapixel count. Anyway, this is LG we're speaking of, which means that pretty much everything is possible. Release Date and Price An earlier-than-usual Q1 2016 launch with a price tag north of $600. In mid-November, Korean outlet ET News reported that the LG G5 is set for release during the first quarter of 2016, which means LG will be launching earlier than usual this year. 
its last flagship smartphones, the LG G4 and the LG G3, were released in late April and late May, respectively. The source claims LG is pushing to release the phone right after its announcement, and may have already started initial production of the LG G5 to ship in time and secure stocks. With regards to pricing, all the premium design materials and hardware components featured in the smartphone will probably place its price tag in the flagship smartphone segment, which is, loosely, north of $600.